It was a murder in the full light of day, and it ripped the blinders off for the whole world to see. Yes. Hopefully this is the momentum for the George Floyd Justice and Policing Act to get past to have you sign. This verdict brings us a step closer. And the fact is, we still have work to do. George Floyd was murdered almost a year ago. There's meaningful police reform legislation in his name. You just heard the vice president speak of it. She helped write it. Legislation to tackle systemic misconduct in police departments, to restore trust between law enforcement and the people they're entrusted to serve and protect. But it shouldn't take a whole year to get this done. When tomorrow's vaccine and vaccination numbers come out, we will show that today we did it. Today we hit 200 million shots and the 92nd day in office. No working American should lose a single dollar from their paycheck because they chose to fulfill their patriotic duty of getting vaccinated. The United States sets out on the road to cut greenhouse gases in half, in half by the end of this decade. That's where we're headed as a nation. And that's what we can do if we take action to build an economy that's not only more prosperous, but healthier, fairer, and cleaner for the entire planet. The signs are unmistakable. The science is undeniable. But the cost of inaction is, keeps mounting. 